Tanks, big, powerful, and built for war. Today, we're looking at two of the best, the Russian T-90M Pro Riv and the German-made Leopard 2A6. These aren't your granddad's tanks. Oh no, these are packed with the latest tech, ready to rumble in the 21st century. Think of them as heavyweight boxers, each with their own strengths and weaknesses. The T-90M is like a tough brawler, while the Leopard is more like a skilled technician. Which one comes out on top? Well, that's what we're here to find out. Buckle up, folks, because things are about to get explosive. So, why are these two tanks so important? Because they represent the cutting edge of armored warfare. Both Russia and NATO countries have poured resources into developing these machines. And what we're seeing in the current conflict is a real-world test of their capabilities. Let's not forget the human element. Tanks are only as good as the people operating them, and both sides have highly trained crews ready to push these machines to their limits. This isn't just about metal and firepower, it's about strategy, tactics, and the will to win. First up, we have the T-90M Pro Riv, Russia's main battle tank. It's a beast of a machine designed to dominate the battlefield. Imagine this, a 50-ton monster rumbling across the terrain at 60 kilometers per hour. The T-90M is all about firepower and protection. It boasts a massive 125 millimeter cannon that can punch through almost any armor. Plus, it's bristling with explosive reactive armor, ERA, that can stop anti-tank missiles dead in their tracks. But that's not all. This tank also has an active protection system called Arena M. Picture this, an enemy fires a missile, but before it can hit, the Arena M system launches a projectile that intercepts it in mid-air. Talk about a close shave. However, the T-90M isn't perfect. While it's tough and deadly, it's not as technologically advanced as the Leopard. Its gun sights and targeting systems aren't as sophisticated, and its crew ergonomics are a bit cramped. Now, let's meet the Challenger. The Leopard 2A6, hailing from Germany, is like the sleek, sophisticated boxer in this matchup. It's a bit heavier than the T-90M, but don't let that fool you. This tank is no slouch when it comes to speed and agility. The Leopard's main weapon is a 120mm cannon that's renowned for its accuracy and stopping power. It can hit targets at long range with pinpoint precision thanks to its advanced targeting systems and thermal imaging. What sets the Leopard apart is its superior crew ergonomics and situational awareness. Imagine sitting inside a high-tech cockpit with all the information you need at your fingertips. That's what it's like to operate this beast. However, the Leopard does have a few drawbacks. Its heavier weight can be a disadvantage in certain terrains, and its reliance on passive armor, while still excellent, might not be as effective against the latest anti-tank weapons. So how do these two tanks stack up in a head-to-head -head fight? It's a tough call. The Leopard has the edge in long-range engagements thanks to its superior firepower and accuracy, but the T-90M's active defenses and reactive armor could give it an advantage at close range. The reality is that tank warfare is rarely a fair fight. It's about using terrain, strategy, and supporting units to your advantage. In the current conflict, both tanks have had their share of successes and failures. What's clear is that the future of tank warfare is evolving. Drones, loitering munitions, and advanced anti-tank missiles pose a significant threat to even the most heavily armored vehicles. The T-90M and Leopard 2A6 represent the pinnacle of current tank design, but the question remains, how will they adapt to the challenges of future warfare? Only time will tell.